Some residents are left wondering what's next after a building at the Columbia Crossing Apartments caught on fire. ABC 17's Joshua Blount is live from where that fire sparked up. Joshua, firefighters say they're still working to find out what started the fire. Yeah, Zach, in the last 15 minutes, we learned that the apartment, this building right here, caused the, the fire caused about $15,000 in damages. Firefighters tells me the apartment, the fire started in a basement unit in the kitchen. What ignited the fire is still under investigation. I was able to speak with people who live inside this building about what happened. It was a sound most of us are familiar with, a sound that saved Whitney Eason and her roommate's life today. I was staying in the apartment literally right next to it. When I walked out, because I went out the back door, the door was open and there was this black thing and a lot of smoke just coming out. And I was like, okay, we need to go. Firefighters responded to the 1500 block of Town Drive around 1040 and found smoke coming from the apartment. Firefighters tell me the fire was able to get put out pretty quickly once they got to the scene. Easton says she is glad to be safe, but she is still concerned about her belongings. I have work tomorrow. I don't know what I'm supposed to do to keep it normal. And I just fixed my car and my car keys are in there. Like I like my car broke down two days ago and now a fire. It's too much. And firefighters say no one was hurt during this fire. Reporting live from Columbia, Joshua Blount, ABC 17 News.